Hey guys, this is Kirsty here from Artie Pants and today I'm going to be showing you how to create these beautiful bubble designs on ceramics. So here we go. You're going to need your ceramic paint, a glass of water, some liquid hand soap, plastic straw and spoons, plastic cups and of course your ceramics. So first of all, give your paint a little bit of a shake and squeeze out a small amount into your cup. About one centimetre should do it. Then tip a little bit of water in, about the same amount again, and a good squeeze of the liquid hand soap. Now it's time for the mixing. I like to use the opposite end of a paintbrush to do this. Just mix in until it's all thoroughly combined. Now it's time for some fun. Grab your straw and start to blow some bubbles until they reach about the top of the cup. Once they've done this, then give it another quick mix just to get the paint pigment through all the bubbles again. And then you can start to blow some bubbles again and basically just let them drop onto your ceramic wherever you would like them. Don't worry if your bubbles actually spill over the sides of your ceramics. This is actually a good thing as it will help to coat the edges for you. If you miss some parts, don't worry either because we can fix that up in a moment. Just be careful not to accidentally drink the bubbles and maybe keep your hair out of the way unlike me in this video. But just have some fun with it. In a second, we're going to show you a quick time lapse of the bubbles popping and drying on their own. This usually takes a few minutes can just sit and watch them pop. Looks pretty cool. Now that most of your bubbles have popped, you can see if there's any areas you may have missed. So just grab your spoon and fill in some of those gaps. Now we're going to give this a go with two colours. So the same process as before, squeezing in some paint. We've sped this up a little bit for you guys. Add in equal parts water to that paint. And a good squeeze of our liquid hand soap. Any brand is fine. Give both of those colours a good mix, making sure it's all combined really well. And now it's time for the bubbles again. So blow your bubbles to the top of the cup. Once again, mix those through, getting the paint pigment through the bubbles. Start blowing and dropping onto your ceramic. You'll notice this time that I've grabbed a spoon, so I'm holding the cup in one hand, spoon in the other, and I'm actually leaving some spaces. Those spaces will be where the next colour goes. So just keep blowing those bubbles continuously and guiding them on with your spoon. Now it's time to let those bubbles pop. This time I help them along just by tapping them very gently, but I never touch the ceramic. Now it's time to do our second colour. So same process as before, start blowing those bubbles to the top of the cup and then you'll give it a nice mix again. And then start blowing them onto your ceramic in those empty spaces. You don't have to be too perfect with it. They look lovely when they overlap. The colours I've used here are the blue and the aqua, which are both in our DIY kits and the previous coasters, that was our pink that I used. Just filling in all those empty spaces. Don't have to be too perfect, they will blend beautifully together. They are two of my favourite colours. Once again, if you've missed any areas or your edges, you can always fill those in at the end using your spoon. So that's pretty much it. And here is what they look like after they've dried. Next, we'll show you what they look like after they've been glazed and fired. So here are our gorgeous masterpieces. This really is such a super fun and easy technique to do. If you would like to do this yourself, then head over to our website, artypants.com.au and send us a message. Until then, happy painting.